Nanda Maharaj and Krishna took Krishna on his, and they took Krishna and Balaram on their laps immediately. They, they, even though Krishna was quite elderly at that time, not elderly, but, but still from, in the mother's eyes, full of love, they always see their children as defenseless and, and young and needing protection. So one of Krishna's names is Navin Krishna also. You know that? Krishna. It's one of Krishna's names. Navin Krishna. Did you know that? Yeah, but yes. But also Navin Krishna. One of Prabhupada's disciples was his name Navin Krishna. Okay. Now one one of the things is that if I ask questions and you're so enthusiastic and intelligent, but still, like school, you have to raise your hand. And like school, if you just wait till I call on you, point to you, then it will be less chaotic. Okay, you got the idea? Naveen Poo and everyone. Okay, why did you come here this morning? So many devotees is there. Yes, Paul. <laughs> Wrong answer. <laughs> You're generous hearted, but still. Anyone else? Yes. To learn the art of chanting, actually, I'm not getting the taste for chanting. I'm doing it mechanically, so I came here to learn the art of chanting. To improve your chanting. Yes. Now, um, I'm going to describe something from Chaitanya Charitamrita that explains really what the art of chanting is. Actually, when Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was speaking to Prakashananda Saraswati in the seventh chapter of Adi Lila. Um, he was describing to Prakasananda Saraswati uh, an interact because Prakasananda Saraswati asked him a question. He asked Mahaprabhu, "Why do you sing and dance with other sentimentalists, with sentimentalist people? You're a sannyasi. You should be studying what book? Vedanta. Thank you. But you forgot to raise your hand." But you got the right answer, but, but still. Vedanta, this is the service of sannyasis. Why don't you study Vedanta? And why don't you associate with the other sannyasis who are all impersonalist mayavadis in, in Benares? So Chaitanya Mahaprabhu answered that the reason why he didn't study Vedanta was, does anyone know why? His, yeah, okay. Do you know the Sanskrit or, or Bengali? That he, I'll say it. He, he told, Mahaprabhu, Mahaprabhu told, maybe the sound is a little high because it's reverberating according to my ears. He said, my spiritual master told me, Murkutumi. Toma Nahika Vedanta Adhika. You don't have the qualification to study Vedanta. Moko to me. You know what that would mean? Okay. Tell him. Yeah. yeah, you're a fool. No, of course, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was the greatest scholar, and we, we doubt that Sripad Iswara Puri, his spiritual master, would have said that to him. He had full respect for Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. But then he said, don't study Vedanta, but instead, um, Krishna, you have to listen because I'm going to ask you if you understand what this means. Krishna, mantra, japa, kori. 
you help our young friend. You always continuously chant Krishna mantra, chant the Hare Krishna Ma mantra. Because a mantra sar, this mantra is the essence of Vedanta. This is the essence of the Vedic literatures. And it's the essence of the process to continuously chant. You know how to spell mu? How do you spell mu in English? Like the calf is always going mu. M? Oh, oh, yes. And what is mu spelled backwards? Om, see? <laughs> You're a good scholar, I think. <laughs> Do you, what is your name? Santa. Santa. Santa Deep. Santa Deep. Santa Lu. And how old are you? How old? Eleven. And do you have beads with you? Yeah. Okay. So when Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. He said, he told Prakasananda Saraswati, giving him the reason why he doesn't study Vedanta, he chants. And then Mahaprabhu said, after some time, because he had gotten Krishna mantra from his spiritual master, he went to his spiritual master and said, what kind of a mantra have you given me? I chant the mantra, but naturally, spontaneously, I feel ecstatic and I dance and chant. And by chanting Krishna's names, I've become like a madman. What is the nature of this mantra? What, are, or what, are the, what is the nature of Krishna's names? So that was the result of his chanting. And what do you think, how do you think his spiritual master responded? Yes. He was so happy. He was so happy that the result of chanting was coming to his disciple. And that result is prema, love for Krishna. That is the result of chanting. A mantra sar. This mantra is the essence of all the Vedic literatures. It is the, the if you take the Vedic literatures and pull out the exact essence, because they are vast. It's this mantra, and the result of this mantra, again, is prema bhakti. That is the proper result. In the last, okay, here's, are you, do you like math? Do you like mathematics? No, okay, <laughs> we'll ask someone else. Okay, there are 20 chapters in Antilila of Chaitanya Charitamrita, and the last section of Chaitanya Charitamrita from 14 to 19 describes Mahaprabhu's ecstasy in Jagannath Puri. How many chapters describe Mahaprabhu's ecstasy? Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 17, 18, 19. So, so in those chapters, uh, this, the pastimes of Mahaprabhu, his final pastimes are described, and the devotees in Vrindavan had asked Krishna Das Kaviraj Goswami to describe this because they hadn't heard these pastimes before. They had read Chaitanya Bhagavata, and they would speak about the life of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and Chaitanya Bhagavata. But these last pastimes 
Krishna's Kaviraj Goswami, they asked him because he was he was known as a Kaviraj, so he was from a Vaidya family, but also he was a great poet. And if you read Chaitanya Charitamrita, you can see the wonder of his writing ability. It is it is very inspiring and sweet and beautiful. <coughs> so in chapters 14, and one may ask, Kaviraj Goswami was in Vrindavan. So how did he know of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's final pastimes? Because he actually never personally met Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Does anyone know the answer to that? Raise your hand. Yes, Paul. Yes, thank you. What is your good name? We have to give credit to Ritvik. Yes. Thank you, Paul. How did you know the answer to that? How did you know? So he had heard from Raghunath Das Goswami, who was personally assisting Sruptamara Goswami, and Sruptamara Goswami and Ramananda Roy had witnessed, they were personally there with Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu those final years, and Raghunath Das Goswami being so exalted, being perfectly on the spiritual platform himself, he assisted Sukhtamara and he watched all these pastimes going on. And then after Sikh Chaitanya Mahaprabhu left this world, and, and after um, Sukhtamara, who he was serving, left this world, Raghunath Das went to Sri Vrindavan and he was under the shelter of Srila Rupa Goswami and Srila Sanatana Goswami. And the devotees there, um, they asked him, please write down the final pastimes of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, because no one had ever heard them. And no one, especially, yeah, no one had ever heard them. So he was a student disciple, Siksha disciple of Raghunath Das Goswami. So he heard everything. And because Kaviraj Goswami, Krishna's Kaviraj Goswami was so pure, he was able to assimilate everything. Uh, what is this? How would you, what does assimilate mean? Another word for it in English, and then I'll ask for Hindi. Assimilate, not exactly. Digest, Digest absorb properly. Because sometimes we hear things that are very, very high in spiritual life, but our consciousness is not yet high, so we can't quite absorb or digest those concepts yet, but maybe one day we will be able to. So in the final chapter, not 14, not 15, not 16, not 17, not 18, and not 19, Kaviraj Goswami begins that chapter. And let me just say a few words about what's discussed in the 14th and 19th chapter. Mahaprabhu was so ecstatic in the mood of separation, missing Krishna. So before you can miss Krishna, actually miss him, Vrahabhav, you have to love Krishna because there are so many people in the world that we don't see, but we don't miss them at all. We don't even know them. So you have to have a relationship with someone and then you have to really, really love their association to miss them. So when Srimati Radharani and Krishna, her relationship with Krishna was the highest degree of love, when Krishna would be outside of her presence, she wouldn't be with Krishna for even one second, or even the blinking of the eye, she couldn't see Krishna. She would be thinking, oh, where is Krishna? Where is Krishna? Where is Krishna? And this missing Krishna, wishing, can't, wishing, or thinking one is, I'm not able to live one moment without Krishna. This causes great ecstasy for the soul. 
great ecstasy. So looking at it from the outside, just an observer who doesn't understand spiritual life deeply, one may think it looks like suffering. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, taking the mood of Srimati Radharani as described in these 14th to 19th chapters, she was in the mood of Radharani missing Krishna. And there was such ecstasy that his hair was standing on edge continuously. And sometimes blood would be coming from the skin pores. Sometimes, sometimes the joints between between all the joints in his body would be separated. The body would be separated, it would be six inches between each joint. And sometimes all his limbs would be compressed within his body like a, a turtle. Or, and he would look almost like a pumpkin of some sort. And the devotees would chant and chant loudly to bring him out of his internal mood, and then his body would become regular. But internally, rather than suffering, he was experienced the greatest ecstasy of separation from Krishna. In the eighth chapter of Madhya Lila, when Mahaprabhu and Sri Ramananda Roy are speaking, we learn that in separation, in the ecstasy of missing Krishna. Oh, where is Krishna? Where is Krishna? Where is Krishna? It is the exact same experience as being with Krishna, being in his presence. So Mahaprabhu, in these chapters, was doing two things. He was relishing or tasting the ecstasy of Srimati Radharani that she was experiencing in separation from Krishna. And also he was teaching us how to become in Krishna's presence and how to also achieve the highest platform of prema bhakti. Two things. What were those two things? But raise your hand. Let's see if, if anyone was listening. What were those two things he was teaching? If you know the answer, if you think you know the answer, raise your hand. If you didn't catch it, don't raise your hand because I'm not a very good teacher. So I'll, go, I'll say it again. When Mahaprabhu was experiencing these things as described throughout Chaitanya Charitamrita, but especially in the 14th and 19th chapter, he was doing two things at the same time. How many? Two things. Okay, this time I'll try to be a better teacher. One of them, he was himself wanted to relish aswad. He wanted to taste, Krishna himself wanted to taste the loving ecstasy that Srimati Radharani had. He was experiencing, Krishna was in the mood of Sri Radha, the highest lover of Krishna, the highest prem. He wanted to taste that himself. So what was one thing? That... Raise your hand if you can say what that one thing is. Don't worry, I, want to, I won't call on you, I'll just, okay. I did a little bit at that time, but I'm going to have to try again because... But please help me by listening carefully. Mahaprabhu was doing two things at the same time. Mataji, if you're taking videos, you're not going to be able to raise your hand at all about that you heard what I'm saying because you'll be, you'll be in the world of media events as opposed to the world about hearing about Chaitanya Mahaprabhu in the holy names. So he was doing two things. How many things? Two. two. Okay, we, so far we got that part. Okay, one, he himself was wanted to experience, Krishna himself wanted to experience the love of Srimati Radharani. 
So he was tasting that. He was experiencing that. Is that clear? Yes, in the back? Okay. And the second thing, he was teaching us how we could experience the highest ecstasy of love for Krishna. The second thing was that he was teaching us, the readers, the devotees, the path of experiencing the highest love for Krishna. If I, I'm not going to ask you, but if I were to ask you the two things, would you be able to answer? <laughs> I'm not going to ask you, but do you think you would be able to answer? No, okay. Of course, if I could say it in Hindi or Telugu or Canada, then I'd probably do better, but I can't. So I'm stuck with English only. But let's move on. Okay. Now, in the 20th chapter, the final chapter of Anti Lila, the final chapter of Chaitanya Charitamrita, how many chapters are in Anti Lila? Plus one, the 20th. In the 20th, this is how Kaviraj Goswami begins. What were you thinking right now while I was going through the pages? Yeah. Yes. Yes. 20th chapter is called the Sikshastakam. And what were you thinking? No. No. Yes, our old friend. Yeah, okay. So this is what Kaviraj goes, how he begins his 20th chapter. And the 14th to the 19th, he's described the internal ecstasy of Mahaprabhu. And here he says, I'll just read the English though. I, is it projected? First verse. Only the most fortunate will relish. Somehow this sometimes works and sometimes doesn't work. It's, uh, at some point later, we'll take a, a break and change the battery. Do we have another battery? Okay, but not yet. Because it sometimes works. He says, this is the first verse. Only the most fortunate will relish the mad words of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, which were mixed with jubilation, envy, agitation, submissiveness, and grief, all produced by ecstatic, loving emotions. Only the most fortunate can actually understand the ecstasies because if one isn't deep enough, they appear to be suffering, grief, jubilation, envy, because Mahaprabhu in his ecstasy is acting in these ways. And then the second verse, everyone say together. Jai Jai Gora Chandra, Jai Jai Anityananda. Jaya Dvaita Chandra Jaya Gaura Bhakta Vrinda All glories to Lord Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu All glories to Lord Nityananda All glories to Adwaita Chandra And all glories to all the devotees of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu While Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was thus residing, living in Jagannath Puri, Nalachala. Raise your hand if you've been to Jagannath Puri, Nalachala. Almost 80%. He was continuously overwhelmed night and day by separation from Krishna. He was experiencing ecstasy 
continuously. What is a, a Sanskrit word for continuously? You say sada narantra was the one I was thinking. Continuously. Or we say kirtaniya sadahari, always, always continuously chant. Day and night, he was in deep ecstasy. Day and night, he tasted blissful songs and verses with his two associates, namely Sukhdamana Goswami and Ramananda Roy. So he wasn't alone. He was with Ramananda Roy and Sukhdamana as he was in the mood, Krishna in the mood of Sri Radha chanting and experiencing Radharani's mood of separation from Krishna. The deepest of topics. He relished the symptoms of various transcendental emotions. So these were not material, rather they were experienced on the spiritual platform of ecstasy. So he relished the emotions of jubilation, means happiness, lamentation, Sanskrit for lamentation, shoka, anger, humility, anxiety, grief, eagerness, and satisfaction. So he was experiencing all these emotions that we don't really have the ability to understand what they were like on the transcendental platform because all our experiences of grief and humility and anxiety and eagerness and satisfaction spring from our material concepts. But Mahaprabhu was experiencing these on the transcendental level of prema bhakti. And he would recite his own verses. He would express their meanings and emotions. And thus, he would enjoy tasting them with his two friends. Name one of his two friends. Raise your hand. Matiti. Name one of his two friends. No. Through Tamaran, Ramananda Roy. And sometimes the Lord would be so absorbed in a particular emotion, he would stay up all night reciting verses and relishing their taste. His ecstasy was so great that he would stay up all night immersed in one specific emotion. In great jubilation and great happiness, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu said, my dear Srup Damara and Ramananda Roy, know it from me that chanting the holy names is the most feasible, possible means of salvation to free oneself from the clutches of material existence. It is the most practical, possible, feasible way to free oneself from material existence in the age of Kali. Kalo nasteva, 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 nasteva gati So, what's going to happen in this chapter, which is entitled the Shikshastakam Prayers, is Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is going to do a few things. And at the end, when we fully have developed love for Krishna, that same chanting of the holy names is there. And the eight verses of Shikshastakam, they describe from the beginning to the end, the process from, from the first start of Krishna consciousness to the end of Prema Bhakti, the mood that we advance in step by step by step. So now Mahaprabhu is going to describe the first verse and the first two verses actually, Srila Bhakti Sinanta Saraswati Thakur explains 
that they describe they, they describe nam tattva. Now, what is nam tattva? Raise your hand if you can say what nam tattva is. What does nam tattva mean? Yes, book. Yes, the philosophy of why we chant tells us the truth about the holy names. The first two verses describe that. The glories of the holy names, the potency of chanting Krishna's holy names. The first two verses describe that. And at the end of the second verse and the third verse describe the process of chanting so that you will advance step by step by step. In Kunti Devi's press, there's one, um, have, have any, does anyone know what canto of the Bhagavatam Kunti Devi's prayers are? In? Yes, but you have to, yes, Mataji. Yes, and do you know what chapter they're in? I'll give you a hint. After seven and before nine. <laughs> What's after seven and before nine? Huh? Yeah. Just like if someone asked you um, what you did after this class was over, you'd say, I ate prasadam. But it said, anyway, never mind. Different word, but eight. So in the eighth chapter, Kunti Devi says, Jan my swaya sutasi vire zamana manapumam na, anyone know the next part? Na eva arhati. That's a by Kim Kinshina Gosala. Now, Prophet's purport there is very important. And he describes in that purport that the chanting can do everything for us. It can bring us from the lowest stage to the topmost stage. But there is a quality of the chanting that makes a difference. There's a quality in the chanting that makes the difference. And if we chant in the proper way, with the proper quality, then we will advance step by step by step to the very topmost. So for myself, and as one Mataji said, we're here to improve our chanting, to improve the quality of our chanting so that we advance step by step to the proper goal. And what is the goal? Raise your hand. What is the actual goal of chanting? What is the actual result of chanting? No, don't. Some of these things are very secret. And they should only be revealed when you get pointed at Esmantiji. Yes, Krishna Prema. And what does Krishna Prema mean? L complete love of Krishna being absorbed and thoughts of Krishna by that love. That is the natural constitutional position of every soul. And until we have that, we will never feel satisfied regardless of what else we have. Until we have that, we will never feel satisfied or fulfilled, regardless of what else we have. Do you believe that? It's so easy to say Hari Bol to that, but it's so hard to live it. All those who want to love Krishna say Hari Bol, and we'll Hari Bol, but, and all those who, who want to do what's necessary to love Krishna, say Hari Bol. So, <laughs> okay, Krishna heard you. Now you're going to have to do it. Because that's, that's really, of course, not with you, devotees, but that's the case. All those who want to love Krishna, oh, yes, all those who want to do whatever is required to love Krishna, then they'll 
silence. It's a complete giving of the soul, the self, to Krishna. You know, when when you look at some ad advertisement for something and they say, free car with every purchase of tissues or something. <laughs> and then you read at the bottom, there's a little sign, condition supply. And then there's so many conditions. Well, the conditions are that one has to follow the, the guidance of the great souls to chant Hare Krishna that Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is giving here. Those are the only conditions. So he's going to explain. I'm going to read it because you're all familiar. If, if Could we recite the, the verses now, the first two verses, beginning with Taito Dharpana Vajanam? Okay. <laughs> Okay, so Mahaprabhu is saying that the, the way to get free from the material energy in this age of Kali, the children, yes, and the parents are giving them shelter, protecting them at all times, and they're confident of their, the protection of their parents. They have full shelter. This is how they're thinking. Therefore, they can be peaceful and just play all day long and be happy. Everything is provided for them. So if one chants the holy name of the Lord, he's very intelligent, Kavi Raja Swami says, and he attains shelter at the lotus feet of Krishna. Therefore, he's living in ecstasy, Vishwapurna Sukhayate, we usually criticize the material world as Dukalayama, Sasvatama, Nitya Sukham Loka. But for a devotee, on the proper level, Vishwapurna Sukhayate, even this Vishwa, this universe is a place of happiness, complete happiness. And then he explains in two verses that Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, or one verse in the 10th verse, that Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is the avatar, the Lord who's descended to this world, Krishna who has descended to, to distribute the holy names to everyone out of his mercy. So that verse is Krishna Varnam, Trisha Krishna, Sangha Ketse, Yagyai, thank you, Tana Praya, Yajanti Sumayasa. In the age of Kali, intelligent persons perform congregational chanting, thank you, time, to worship the incarnation of Godhead who constantly sings the names of Krishna. So this is the best worship of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Raise your hand if you have Gornatai deities in your home. Raise your hand if you have Gornatai picture in your home. Well, the best worship of Kornitai is to chant Krishna's names, is to always be involved in chanting the holy names of Krishna. That's the best worship of C.C. Kornitai. 
And even if you, they aren't in your home, and even if you aren't in your home, the best worship of Krishna is to chant his holy names. And the best habit that one could ever have, do you have good habits? Do you have good habits? Do you have bad habits too? Yes. And the question is, do you have the best habit? The best habit is this, to always chant the Hare Krishna Mahamantra. When even Mahaprabhu, when he, right when he took sannyas, that day no one knew he was going to take sannyas, but all those who loved him, they naturally came to him, they came to him every day. And you know what he told them? He, he knew he was going to take sannyas and not see them again in Sridhar Mayapur. He told them, when you are sleeping, when you are eating, ki bojane, ki jagarane, or when you're awake, ahadina krishna, ahadina krishna chinta. Always think of krishna, balivo vadane. Always think of Krishna, whether you're sleeping, awake, eating, even always think of Krishna and chant his holy name. This is the best of all habits said by Srila Rupa Goswami. If you can do this one thing, you will fly as easily to the spiritual world as, what's the rest of the example? <laughs> Go ahead, try. Who's who's going to be a poet here? Yes. As Garuda, keep going. You have to finish. You'll be able if you always chant Krishna's names, you will fly to the spiritual world just as easily as Garuda. Go ahead. Flaps his wings, okay, and goes to the spiritual world. Yes. If we can just develop this habit of the constant chanting, this is Mahaprabhu's recommendation, actually. And it is, it is the solution to all problems, all problems, mental problems, because in Kali Yuga, especially if you're a software engineer or something like that, always so much is going on in the mind all the time and so many problems exist. Or if you're married to a software engineer. <laughs> <laughs> this is the best solution. And one hint, the best solution is not to say, yes, your problem is this, you should always chant. <laughs> the best solution is to take the medicine yourself. But one really has to be sincere to do that, to take it. It sounds so simple, it is so simple, but why don't we do it? That will come at the end of the, the verse, second verse, but even aside from that, we have to be so sincere to constantly take shelter of Krishna through his holy names. But do it. If you can develop this habit, sincere or insincere, you will become sincere. You become the best of persons. You become the best of devotees. And it doesn't make the difference whether you are little or 11, which is not little. It's quite a good size. Or 22 or 32, or it doesn't make a difference what body you're in. Although, um, yeah, sometimes there are birds who learn how to chant. In, the, in one temple in New Zealand, they had a cockatoo. They don't have cockatoos in India, but they had trained him to chant Krishna's names. He chant, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. And it was so nice to play with him. He went, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. But then when a cat comes, <laughs> you forget it. <laughs> So we don't want to become that kind of chanting. We want to be always with Krishna through chanting his holy names, even when there's great difficulty, especially when there's great difficulty. So in this age of Kali, intelligent persons 
performed congregational chanting to worship the incarnation of Godhead, who constantly sings the name of Krishna, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Although his complexion is a Krishna, he's not blackish, he is Krishna himself, and he's accompanied by his associates, servants, weapons, and confidential companions. And simply by chanting the holy name of Krishna, one can be freed from all undesirable habits. This is the means, the way, the process of awakening all good fortune. Because <laughs> in Kali Yuga, everyone is, tends to be abhagya, means unfortunate. And we look at other people and we say, oh, they have more, they're more fortunate than I am. Why this? Why that? Only if I had this and that unfortunate, unfortunate. And that uh, all knowledge comes. Knowledge of not only who we are but not as a soul, but knowledge who we are in relationship with Krishna eternally. We all have an eternal relationship with Krishna and that knowledge also comes. Anandam Bhuti Vardam, an ever increasing ocean of bliss. Patipatam <coughs> Pona and one Pona Amrita Aswadhanam. One feels like one is being bathed continuously in nectar, ecstatic. So Vapma Snapadam, the soul, he feels himself being bathed. So this is the result, Parambhajayate, and this holy name will be victorious over the material energy, Parambhajayate, Sri Invested all your potencies in those names, and there are no hard and fast rules for remembering them. If you perform a Vedic sacrifice, you have to do it in this time and in this way, and you have to be at this level of purity and this rule and that rule and this and that and this and that. But with the holy names, there are no hard and fast rules. Even the deities, sometimes the curtains are closed and you can't see them. But with the holy names, there is no limitation. Any time you want to be with Krishna, you can chant. His holy names, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. So then the question comes, well, as much as he said, I've been chanting for so long. Why isn't this my experience? And he says, my dear Lord, although you bestow such mercy, you have made yourself so easily available any time, any place you can be, you want, you can be with Krishna. You bestow such mercy upon the fallen conditioned souls by liberally teaching your holy names. But I am so unfortunate that I commit offenses while chanting the holy name. And therefore, I do not achieve attachment for chanting. Usually, not usually, but some of us, maybe many of us, our goal is to finish our rounds, get them done, complete them, so we can go on with other things. But that's not the sign of someone who has complete taste an attachment for chanting the holy name. So why don't we get the attachment, the taste? And the answer is given here too, because I commit offenses. So therefore, when we begin the chanting of the holy names at initiation, generally our Guru Maharaj will tell us the 10 offenses that we should avoid. So that's so important. And even the next verse, Trinata Pisuni, Trinata Turoda Pisi, Sinamani Namanadena, where one is, will naturally relate to everyone else with all respect and a serving mood with no pr pride, which is the verse that Srila Bhakti Sanatasaraswati Thakur says 
is the method, the way to chant the holy names. In these first two verses, the glory of the holy names is given. And in the third verse is how to chant the holy names, the methodology of chanting. But Srila Bhaktivinoda Thakur also explains that, the, that humility and respectfulness and tolerance and generosity of spirit, what one gives and gives, Taroda, peace, and he's like a tree, gives shelter to even the person and fruit in its wood to even the person who cuts it. That natural mood comes from, Srila Bhaktivinoda Thakur says, that mood naturally comes from offenseless chanting of the holy names. It's natural if one chants without offense. That generosity of spirit. So it's so important to avoid the offenses against the holy names. But it's also important to be inspired to chant the holy names by understanding the glories of the holy names. That just by chanting Krishna's names, all miseries will be eliminated and the flow of love for Krishna will begin in our heart. If we don't have that inspiration, it's difficult to continue. So Namatatva, the glories of the holy name, is the first points that are made by Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu so that we can learn how, to, so we can learn, to, so we're inspired to chant Krishna's name seriously and get the results of chanting Krishna's holy names. And one of the offenses is inattention. So in the beginning of our chanting, there's an emphasis on attentive chanting to not let the mind wander here and there because the mind is filled with so many thoughts, so many desires, and the mind is, tends to be quite unruly in Kali Yuga, not at all peaceful, jumping from one thing to, to the other, from one internet site to another, from one desire to another, and actually mobile phone usage it increases the vata element in the mind and makes it even more difficult to control and less satisfied and less peaceful. How many of you have your mobile phones with you at this very moment? How many of you don't have your mobile phone with you? Me too. And you don't even have a mobile phone. Do your friends have mobile phones? Do your friends have mobile phones? And you don't. Do you feel bad sometimes because your friends have a mobile phone and you don't? You're very intelligent. <laughs> and your parents are very intelligent. Because it's not actually healthy for the mind. And if your mind is unhealthy, your life will be so difficult. And if your mind is strong and healthy and your body is strong and healthy, and your intelligence is strong and healthy, and you have spiritual goal in life, your life will be so much better and happy. So many people have, even in even high school and college students, they have to take antidepressive medication and things like that. I don't know if it's like that here, but in, in the West, it's really like that, so sad. They have to take pills to stop them from being miserable. But those pills hurt your mind so badly also. And then you have to take another pill to counteract the effect of that pill. So if, if, if you can use your phone maturely at one stage, you may have one, um, then it's okay. But to spend too much time on it, it's not so healthy. 
and all the advertisements for the iPhone 15 Pro Ultra and on and on and on and on as if and, and as if and the, I got the 14 Pro Ultra because I thought it would make me happy and then they, they've cheated me and got one better and for for two months, I was like the coolest person around because I had that top photo. Actually. You have a 13? <laughs> <laughs> and now, so <clears throat> if we can just hear the mantra, that's a, such an important stage. It's not the final stage but it's a, a very important first stage. So what we're going to do now, I spoke too much too long, excuse me. But what we're going to do now is everyone take out your beads and we're going to chant with one goal in this chanting. And that one goal is to try to hear one mantra, not even every mantra or even one mantra at a time. If you can hear one Hare Krishna Mantra Sava Papa Chai, all, all sins are removed. Eka Mantra Krishna Zappa, a Mantra no, Sava Papa Chai. So while we're chanting now, maybe it will overload the electricity if we put some fans on? It is on. This one, this one is, but I was thinking of the, are the other all on? Okay. No, it's, it's okay. If you want, you can turn that on and if, you'll, if it'll help the devotees nearby, maybe. If you want, you can do it. Um, I just distracted you from chanting. Just testing you. <laughs> um, try to chant, and as we're chanting, I'll speak a little bit to help us, remind us. All we have to do is hear one mantra, beginning with Hari, Hari, Krishna, Hari, Krishna, Krishna, Krishna Hari, Hari, and then Hari, the Hari, Rama, Hari, Rama. Just keep that for one mantra. If you can hear one mantra, keep that as your goal for this chanting session. Anyone have any questions on that point? Yes. <coughs> then you can go. But if you leave, you'll miss prasadam. <laughs> but just keep that as a goal and see what happens next. It'll make you so happy that you want to chant another, if you like, but if you don't want to, it's okay. And someone sometimes will ask the question, I don't know if I've really heard or not, I'm answer. And the answer is try your best. I'll explain why maybe later, but I don't want to talk anymore now. Okay, take out your beads and offer prayers to Guru Vaishnava, Srila Prabhupada, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, the Pansitattva, your deities where you get the most shelter, and try to chant Krishna's names. And if you can hear one Hare Krishna mantra, you're so fortunate. But I, the problem is, Mataji, I've talked so long already that it would be nice if the devotees chant, but you can be the first person who can ask the question after. Okay? Okay. So if you can hear one mantra, just try to hear one mantra beginning with that. Make that the goal right now. 
And if your mind wanders, don't worry, just try your best. Bring it back to the simple goal of trying to be with Krishna in the form of His holy names. Remember, Krishna is actually there in His holy names. Focus. Try your best, okay? Try your best. Try your best, okay? And if your mind wanders, don't worry, just bring it back to trying again. Try your best. Focus. Please try your best. If the mind wanders, don't worry, it's natural. Just bring it back to the simple goal of trying to hear one Hare Krishna mantra beginning with Hare. And if you can hear Hare Krishna and a little later Hare Rama. You can stand up and say it because you look a little tired. Rama 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 Hari Hari Krishna Rama 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 Hari Hari Krishna Rama 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 Hari Hari Krishna Rama 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 Hari Hari Hurry, 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 Ram, my Ram, my Ram, my hurry, hurry, kiss, hurry, kiss, hurry, kiss. Hurry, 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 Ram, my Ram, my Ram, my hurry, hurry, kiss, hurry, kiss, hurry, kiss. Keep trying your best to hear one Hari Krishna Mahamantra beginning with Hari and hear Hari Rama also. Hare kiss, Hare kiss. Try your best. Um.
Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Krishna Ram Hare 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 Ram Hare Ram Ram Hare Ram 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 Hare Hare Ram 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 Try your best. If you can hear one mantra, if your mind wanders, don't worry. Just bring it back to that simple goal of hearing. Try to be with Krishna by hearing. If you can hear one mantra, the soul fortune. Krishna Krishna Hari Ram Hari Ram 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 Hari Ram 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 Hi Ram, Hi Ram, Hi Ram, Be determined, be determined to try your best. Hare Krishna, Ram 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 very good chanting. Hare Krishna,
Ram Hai Ram 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 Hai 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 Krishna Hai Krishna 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 Hai Hai Ram Hai Ram 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 Hai 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 Krishna Hai Krishna 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 Yeah. 
Are your best.
is focus. Okay, can you hear and not be focused on what you're hearing? Focus on hearing, yes. Yeah, so that's kind of the Yes. But in my mind, it's the same. So this is one stage of energy that we can just be present for the whole name. So that takes determination too. As soon as you realize your mind has wandered, then you must bring it back. And I've also found that say if I was and I realize my mind is been wandering, if I if I if I'm determined this next month I'm going to hear, then I much better chance of being here. And if we chant, we chant, we chant, trying out the we are seeing is that the mind, which tends to be rebellious and passionately running here and there, because all day long our mind is like a horse that's not trained and it's running and running this way wherever it wants. So if we focus for some time, the mind calms down and it understands, oh, I'm supposed to listen. And then it becomes easy by Krishna's grace. So I find, you find that sometimes, sometimes the, the, just hearing becomes like your will. You hear anytime you want. You follow what I mean? That the mind cools down, doesn't run, and then Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, 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 Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna. So then I'm here. So that's actually Krishna's grace. Is mercy. So sometimes my mind is tricky and it says, I can hear anytime I want now. So why hear now? And then Krishna takes away that gift. I've seen that so many times. So if Krishna allows you to hear, then take it as a gift and hear as much as you can. But I'm not sure I answered your question. It had to do with the difference between hearing and concentration almost. So we should concentrate on the sound vibration. Thank you. 
the one to take time for more time. Try to focus on task. When you concentrate on the mantra, so then I feel stress or I feel like uh, uh, getting tired. Yes. So I, I have well, I can only do two push ups. I also felt tired. <laughs> but it's a very good thing, I find that with push ups, 20 only becomes easy when you try to do 25. Then 20 becomes easy. And 25 becomes easy when you try to do 30. So it's a mixture of the material world that no matter what you have, you have to try to do more. Especially in Christian countries, there's a golden frame about the United States in the country that you mind. But there's more. And to, to run out of energy and to fail is also very good. Mahabharata would chant all night long and it goes on to chant and chant and chant and chant and chant and chant They didn't get tired, they didn't sleep, all they didn't sleep because they had that taste. So how do you get that taste? So unless we want to, the first thing is desire. If we don't have the desire, then there won't be any agenda either. Won't be any attempt. And then, when we try very hard, we hit our limitation. Because we try very hard by the strength of our intelligence, our desire, our ability to concentrate, our ability to focus by our own endeavor. But that is necessary, but it's not sufficient. So after Mahaprabhu chants or explains this just the, the, the third verse, which is Trinavati, which is the product of the Texas chant. Um, Trinavati, everyone say the verse? These are the symptoms of the Prasantara Dhammapati said, and one who chants the Hare Krishna mantra, although he is very exalted, he thinks himself lower than the grass on the ground and like a tree, he tolerates everything too late. When a tree is cut down, it does not protest, and even when drying up, it does not ask anyone for water. Can you imagine if Mahaprabhu said, and even when he was trying to drive across a crowded intersection, he would not protest and put himself forward. If you know what I mean, I'm saying that he would never cross the street, he would never be able to get your car anywhere unless you were a little bit goofy. Is that your experience? Okay, so. If you're too polite and humble in this world, you can't even cross the street much as you can do anything and be successful on any level. Is that current? That, that's my experience anyway. So this practical element of this, that we don't envy people, that our heart is trying to serve people, we don't get insulted, we treat others with respect, that kind of thing. So we have to like everything else in Christian consciousness, there's the theoretical ideal, and then there's the practical. And wisdom is knowing how to apply the practical, the wisdom wise principles to the practical life. But I don't want to speak about Trinidad of Peace on that verse. I want to speak about the next verse. But I'll read a little further. Whenever there is a relationship of love of Godhead, his natural symptom is that the devotee did not take himself as a devotee. Instead, he always thinks 
เป็นเรื่องราวที่เป็นเรื่องรอบตอบรับโอเคเป็นเรื่องสุดท้ายแต่เรื่องสุดท้ายที่ฉันอยากจะพูดถึงก็คือถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ถ้าเกิดวันพรุ่งนี้ So I have to feel the hate to be afraid. All those of you in this, I do not desire material wealth or favorites and followers, a beautiful wife or food of activities, subscribing, salary, and participation. All I want, by the end of life, is to get motivated to go to the scripts. Now here, now here is my group at the location of this. Dana, Dana, Nahi, Maho, Kavita, Sutari. Well, Power, Nahi, I do not want these things. Kavita, Sundari, I don't want to get great poets and writing beautiful verses. I don't want a beautiful woman to follow me and things like that. So what do I want? Sunda Bhakti Deha Mordi. I want pure devotional service. They have good rules, good to me, please award me. Krishna Kripa Kori. Please, by your mercy, O Lord, all I want, like that to my family, that I need to say, I want to serve the devotional service. I want to serve you, that's what I want. So when a person is praying, and they want to say the word for me, no one I want to follow is a beautiful wife or the devotional food of activities. I only want that by your court of mercy, he feels that he doesn't have the power to get this by his own self. Madam, Which I want, but it also is other than ten thousand. Which I beg. What's the difference between wanting and begging? Say again. Yes, you can write my name. What's the difference between wanting and begging? Wanting more intense. 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 Wanting more Based on the strength of desire, so I can't live without this. And what is he begging for? The shoulder bhakti. Now, here's what I said: that failure isn't so bad. You're chanting and chanting and trying to focus, you're trying to concentrate, and I can't concentrate for the speed of the two hours. I can't concentrate for two months before my mind starts moving, or or five minutes, or ten minutes, or five hours, or whatever. So what does one do when confronting, confronted with one's limitations, one's ability, his ability? I don't have the personal power to do this. That's the question. And all the rules answering here is begging, is praying to Krishna, Krishna Kori. He please give me this. I can't live without it. I don't want these other things. Maybe my mind is not part of me, because we're not sort of consistent in our desires. All we want is one thing. Part of me wants peace. Part of me wants religion. Part of me wants to be a good.
billionaire part of you wants to be so popular part of you, the most sincere part of you, the real me, please allow me to become a devotee, please allow me to be a servant of those please, please allow these things. This is by your mercy, I can't do it on my own. Mother, I'm begging, I want, I repent want, I need it for my existence. I don't want these other things. My mind sometimes tells me I want these other things. My mind tells me I'm tired. But I also watch my mind very excited one minute later thinking about something completely different. So here, the next stage, Mahabhu is talking about the next stage. When you hit your limitations, you can't go beyond this capacity by, by your own power. Then you have to sincerely, fully beg Krishna. So here, this particular prayer, this particular meditation, this particular verse. I don't want, even though part of me may want this, not that I'm, I don't want it, not that I'm bothered, not so many kavitam. So many desires my crazy mind has and imagines that having these fulfilled, I'll be happy, but I know they won't make me happy. I experience this. Oh Lord, oh Nadevista, oh Lord, be real with me. What I do desire, Tamani, Mama, my desires, Tamani, Tamani, oh Lord, you say, open the door of the universe, provide platform to me. I want devotional service to serve you for no other desire except to please you. I hate to be slaves, that is what I want. Jana, Jana, Nahi, Mother, I don't want to. I don't want to. But what do I want? I thank you. Sundra Bhakti Dayama, do it me. Do the work of the Father, Lord, and Krishna, and the work of God. Please become merciful to me. If you're not merciful to me, I don't have any hope. I didn't want something. Whether I get it or not, I don't really care. But what turns a person into a beggar? That intense need, and I, if I have, don't get this, I won't have anything. But not by my power. I your mercy, your Christian, your dedication, your divine universe, your divine all of your Christians. Please, what is your time that I call prayer? Do you think you can tell me that? I have all of our age. How much do you want? You won't find anyone more worthy of that's based on humility. You have to turn to someone. The chair has to move on. Syndrome. The water chair syndrome. Usually it's the doti on the roller of the chair syndrome. Have any of you ever experienced that? Getting your doti caught on your rolling chair? I have many times. Please, even if I have to take birth again and again, I am your servant. Please allow me to serve you. This is the begging of a devotee for pure devotional service. So when you hit your limitations 
And when, when one's mind with all its material desires, even though we know that those desires won't satisfy us, then where do we turn? Where do we turn is the question. If we turn to Krishna, then we are learning how to become actual devotees. Are those pigeons? Oh, what is the sounds out there? Cows, pigeons? Huh? Rats. Okay. If you have rats, you need cats. But then if you need cats, you need cows. <laughs> and the cows are already there. In Vrindavan, when you hear sounds on your roof, you think, oh, monkeys again. <laughs> Understand what I mean? So hit your limitations. Now we're going to chant again. We have another half hour before the end of our session. And it's, it's too hot. Everyone's getting hungry. Oh, I've just done this. Do we have to do it again? I have to get in that same mood of trying to chant. OK, yes, try again. And deal with your mind when it says, sorry, I don't feel like trying to hear one mantra. I don't feel like hearing any mantras. The only mantra I want to hear is Sarira Vidija Jatendriya Taika. Then become a little introspective and say, well, what do I really want? Do I really want to serve Krishna? Who is the center? Is it me or Krishna? So then when you recognize one's own, when one recognizes one's fallen condition, that we're not really, we say, are you a devotee? Yes. How long have you been a devotee? Well, starting maybe next week, I hope. <laughs> How long have you been a devotee? Yeah, you fell into my trap. A devotee only focuses on Krishna. So therefore, so that'll be the test. See? If you, in difficulty, always turn to Krishna, Kripa Kore Krishna, by your mercy. Krishna Kripa Kore, Sudha Deya. What do you think? <laughs> what do you think of what I just was talking about? Yeah, yeah. So what, what do you think of the process of becoming a devotee when you realize you're not really a devotee? See, Mahaprabhu also explains this in the second chapter of Madhya Lila. He says, na prema ganda, I don't have even the fragrance, what to speak of the substance of prema. Because he said the nature of a devotee if he doesn't feel like he's a devotee. So what do you do when your experience of yourself is that I'm not a devotee. I've been chanting for so long and I'm still not actually a devotee. Love for Krishna. Then I should seek center to someone who has that Yeah, but just don't point at me when you said that. You should pray to Krishna. Please, Sudha Bhakti Krishna Kripa Kore. Please, Krishna. I'm so needy of this thing. And unless you're merciful to me, I don't think I have any hope. That kind of a mood. Could you chant in that way? Huh? Yeah. So when you meet an obstacle, something in your way, that's what you should do. Become a beggar. And there's different stages. So Mahaprabhu is saying in these Shastaka verses. He's praying for pure devotional service here. The next one, he's begging for more. 
a next stage. So from this stage on, it's all begging and requiring mercy. Prior to the stage, when we start with, please try to hear one mantra. It's what you can do with your own will, with your own power of concentration. Try your best. But then, at some point, we realize we need mercy. My best is necessary, but not sufficient. You understand what I'm trying to say? Yes, sir. Yeah, so that takes humility, which is the third verse. Because then there's no pride. You're forced. I want to become a devotee. You're forced to understand. Krishna has held up the mirror to you. And you see the difference between what you think you look like and what you actually look like. And then if you, you can run away and try to get a mirror that looks better, makes you look better. Or you can turn the mirror around so you don't have to look at yourself. Or you can become humble and Krishna, Krishna, please be merciful to me. I want to chant properly. I want to be able to chant with devotion. And my mind is just wandering all over. So prayer enters. Clear? Okay. Now, right now it's according to my very smart watch. It's 136. So let us chant a little while longer. And see how you deal with the fact that you're tired, it's too warm, you're maybe hungry, your mind is saying, I don't feel like it, maybe it's saying that. But try to hear one mantra and just chant in the same way. But as soon as you have any difficulty, see if some sincerity can take birth in your heart. Not as like an experiment, exactly, because that won't work. But see if you want to be with Krishna and the holy names and feel you don't have capacity. And see if some sincerity in your heart can come to really sincerely ask Krishna for some mercy as best you can. What do you think? No, behind one, two, three, four behind you. Yeah, no, you, yes, who turn your head just to the side. Yes, you, what do you think? But not you. Pass it back and when it lands in the hands of the person I'm asking, I'll ask you to stop. One back, yes, what do you think? One thing you think is that I wasn't going to call on you. <laughs> Hare Krishna. What do you think of what I was just saying? Will you try your best now when we chant? Yes, I'll try. Okay. And tomorrow morning when you chant Japa, will you try your best? And then tomorrow, will you come here tomorrow also? Yes, sir. Okay. okay, thank you. Okay. So pray for mercy even before you start. And then when you're ready, just begin to chant. You can start with seeing if you can hear one Hare Krishna mantra and do that as long as you can, because that's such a wonderful thing to be able to, to chant in a focused way. It's it's. Offense is chanting basically. Okay, begin. They kiss me. Rama, 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 Hari Krishna, Hari Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hari Hari. Hari Rama, Hari Rama, Rama Rama, Hari Hari. 
Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Try to try to focus. If you can hear one mantra at the beginning of Hari, you are so fortunate. Try your best. Ram Hai Ram 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 Hai 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 Krishna Hai Krishna 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 Hari 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 Rama Hari Rama 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 Hari 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 Krishna Hari Krishna 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 Hari 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 Rama Hari Rama 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 Hari Bo Are you happy today? Yes. Good. Did you chant a little bit today while everyone's chanting? Huh? Let's start now. Okay. But don't worry. But if you can chant a little bit, it'll be so nice. Okay? Just a little bit, if you can. Thank you. Now, I kiss Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Hare Ram. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Hare. Hey Rab, hey Rab, 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 hey Hari, Hari, Krishna, Hari, Krishna, 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 Hari, 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 Ram, 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 Hari, 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 Krishna, 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 Hari, 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 Ram, Hari, Ram, 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 Hari, 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 Ram, Hari, Ram, 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 Hari, Hari, Krishna, Hari, Krishna, 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 Hari, Hari. Rama Hai Rama Rama Hari Hari Krishna Hari Krishna 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 Hari 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 Rama Hai Rama Rama Hari Hari Krishna Hari Krishna 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 Hari 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 Rama Hai Rama Rama Hari Hari Krishna Hari Krishna Hari Krishna Hari Krishna 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 Hari 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 Rama, Hari Rama, Rama Rama, Hari Hari, Hari Krishna, Hari Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hari Hari, Hari Rama, Hari Rama, Rama Hari Krishna, Hari Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hari Hari, Hari Rama, Hari Rama, Rama Rama, Hari Hari, Hari Krishna, Hari Krishna. Krishna, Hari Hari, Hari Rama, Hari Rama, Rama Rama. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. 
Very good Santi. Thank you. Try your best. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna, Krishna. Rama, 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 Hare Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, 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 Hare Hare. Rama, 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 Hare Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, 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 Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, 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 Hare Hare. Rama, 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 Hare Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, 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 Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, 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 Hare Hare, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. Krishna Krishna Hare 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 Rama 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 Hare Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna Hare Krishna Krishna Hare Hare Rama 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 Hare Krishna Hare Krishna Krishna Hurry, 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 Rama, 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 hurry, hurry, Krishna, 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 hurry, hurry, Rama, 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 hurry, hurry, Krishna, 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 hurry, 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 Rama, 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 hurry, hurry, Krishna, 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 hurry, 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 Rama, focus, focus. Focus, please. <laughs> Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Rama, 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 Hare Hare, Krishna, Hare Krishna. Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Rama, 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 Hare Hare. Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Hare, Rama, 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 Hare Hare, Krishna Krishna, Hare Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama, Hare Hare, Krishna Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, 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 Hare Hare, Krishna, Hare Krishna, 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 Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama, Hare Hare, Krishna, Hare Krishna, 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 Hare Hare. Rama, Hare Rama, Rama, Hare Hare, Krishna, Hare Krishna, 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 Hare Hare. Hare Hare, Hare Rama, 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 Hare Hare, Krishna, Hare Krishna. Krishna Krishna Hare Hare Rama 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 Hare Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare Hare Rama 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 Hare Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare Hare Rama Hare Rama Rama Hare Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare Hare Rama 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 Hare Hare Krishna
Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, 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 Hare Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, 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 Hare Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, 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 Hare Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, 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 Hare Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, 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 Hare Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Rama 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 Hari Hari Krishna 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 Hari Hari Rama 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 Hari Hari Krishna 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 Hari 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 Rama Hari Rama Rama Hari Hari Krishna 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 Hari Hari Rama Hari Rama Rama Hari Hari Krishna Krishna Hari Krishna 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 Hari Hari Hai Rama, Hai Rama, Rama, Hari Hari Krishna, Hari Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hari Hari. Rama, Hai Rama, Rama, Hari Hari Krishna, Hari Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hari Hari. Rama, Hai Rama, Rama, Hari Hari Krishna, Hari Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hari Hari. Rama, Hai Rama, Rama. Ram Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, 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 Hare Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Please try your best Hare Krishna, to be with Krishna in the form of his holy names. Rama, 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 Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, 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 Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Rama, 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 Hare Hare, Krishna Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Krishna Hare Hare, Rama, 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 Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Rama, Rama, Hare Rama, 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 Hare Hare, Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Rama, 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 Hare Hare, Krishna Krishna. Krishna Krishna Hare Hare Rama 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 Hare Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare Hare Rama 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 Hare Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare Hare Rama Hare Rama Rama Hare Hare Krishna Hare Krishna Krishna Hare Hare Rama 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 Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare Hare Rama 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 Ram Hari Ram 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 Hari Hari Krishna 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 Hari Hari Ram Hari Ram 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 Hari Hari That's it, Arjuna Sakapur. Are you going to speak on the books again? So I better stop now so it doesn't get too late. How was your chanting? Do it more focused people in the table. Yeah. Today morning I was alone in the center. Yeah. So I'm not so happy chanting anymore. This is a much better experience. I don't know. You have you have a Sunday program every Sunday? Yeah. What time? From 10 30 to 11. 
early request and the devotees is suggested we should do it at yeah. So maybe it's sometime, even if just a few devotees come, just have a japa session. Yeah. We can do the same thing, basically. You mentioned this last year also. Yeah, yeah. You said that devotees should encourage each other. Yeah. Uh, how should we encourage each other after doing some rounds? That's a I, I meant in general, encourage each other. Just come together and chant. Yeah, and, it was, and give it some instruction. And as you said, in the association of devotees, the chanting is easier. Yeah. So, and then they go back to their own houses. So, yeah. during the week, I think it's wise. Because that gives strength during the week. Hopefully, yeah. that's the idea. You'd like to do it on a Saturday? Yeah, yeah, they'll be, have so a special Saturday. Yeah, they yeah. Can come on Sunday first. yeah, yeah. And you can ask on Saturday, how was your day? What did you realize? How was your week? How's your week been? Have you read any Bhagavad Gita? Did you see the Bhagavad Gita playing out and acting in your life? How about chanting and then chant together? Have discussion rather than a class. And hear of each other's experiences during the week. Try it. Hare, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. Okay. Thank you very much for your sincere. It's not on. Hare Krishna. Seems to be off. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. Hurry, kiss, Ram Harama Mamma, Hari Hari Krishna Ram Harama Mamma, Hari Hari Krishna 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 Ram Haram Haram Mamma, Hari Hari Krishna 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 Hari Haram Haram Mamma, Hari Hari Krishna 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 Ram Haram Haram Mamma, Hari Hari Krishna 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 Hari Haram Haram Mamma, Hari Hari Krishna 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 Hari Haram Haram Mamma, Hari Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Ram Hare Ram Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Ram Hare Ram 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 Hare Hare. Krishna 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 Krishna, Hare Hare.
Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Rama, 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 Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna, Hare Hare. Rama, 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 Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Rama, 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 Hare Hare. Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Rama, 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 Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Ram Hai Ram 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 Hai 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 Ram Hai Ram 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 Hai 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 Ram Hai Ram Hai Ram Hai Ram 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 Hai Hai Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare Achyuta Achyutapur It is fine to get the voltage back Another five minutes it works Otherwise we can't make any announcements also Yeah The sound system is also not Yeah Ram Hai Ram 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 Hai Hai Hare Krishna, Krishna 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 Try your best. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare 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 Ram Hari Ram 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 Hari 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 Krishna Hari Krishna 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 Hari 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 Ram Hari Ram 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 Hari Krishna Hari Krishna 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 Hari 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 Ram Hari Ram 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 Hari Hari Krishna Hari Krishna 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 Hari 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 Ram Hari Ram 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 Hari Hari Krishna Hari Krishna Krishna Hari 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 Ram Hari Ram Rama Rama Hari 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 Krishna Hari Krishna 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 Hari 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 Rama 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 Hari Hari Krishna Hari Krishna 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 Rama 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 Hari Krishna Hari Krishna 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 Hari Hari Rama Hari Rama 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 Hari Hari Krishna Hari Krishna 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 Hari Hari Hai Ram, Hai Ram, Ram Ram, Hai Hai Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hai Ram, Ram Ram, Ram Ram, Hai Hai Krishna, Hai Hai Ram, Hai Ram, Ram Ram, Hai Hai Krishna, Hai Hai Ram, Hai Ram, Ram Ram, Hai Hai Krishna. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. How has your chanting been? A little better than yesterday too. I had a good rest. Prayers also helped. Because it seemed to me you were chanting quite focused. Your chanting was quite focused. So that implies that it's good to get sufficient rest. Not easy, maybe, but so many responsibilities that required. Okay. Okay. 
also probably be good if, because we completely depend on sound. So our sound systems have to be working. Actually, it's because of low voltage. Suddenly, today. It's not usually like this, no. infrequently. Do you have about the Gita course programs and things like that? It goes to question. It's Krishna's mercy today. <laughs> okay. Very Krishna, very Krishna. Yes, I figured that. So what should we do? Should, should we go ahead with the food plan? Huh? Should I announce about the food stuff? Yeah. Just stand in the middle. I have one battery operated. Okay. Thank <laughs> you. 
Thank you, sir.